And now to that number as of this morning. 43.9% of people who are 12 years and older are fully vaccinated in Marion County. That's according to the state's vaccine board, which also reports 352,345 people are protected against the virus. That's out of some 800,000 people who are eligible to get the shot. So how are you feeling about uh, leaving the face coverings behind this morning? News 8's Aliyah Hodges is live downtown. And Aliyah, I know we found that some people aren't, aren't feeling too great about it. Right, so similar to the start of masks being required, the option to continue to wear a mask appears to be split. Most people say that they want to wear a mask because they know not everyone wants to get vaccinated. We spoke to people who say wearing a mask is giving them protection from getting the virus, even though they're vaccinated themselves. Others believe that now that the Marion County mandate has been lifted, they don't think any business should keep mask requirements in place. Now, we heard from some people say that wearing a mask has gone on long enough and they want things to go back to the way they were before the pandemic. Yeah, after this mandate thing's over, my mask is a goner. It's going in the trash can to the dump. I want to protect myself. Everybody's not going to get the shot. So it's like putting myself back at risk just to, you know, because they lift it. I don't agree with it. According to a new survey from Gallup, Americans are getting out more, but cautiously, less than a quarter of Americans, 22% of them say they are practicing social distancing. 44% have avoided events with large crowds in the past week. The survey also finds that 40% of Americans have avoided traveling by airplane or public transportation. 26% have avoided small gatherings with family or friends. Now, although 34% have avoided going to public places Places in general, such as stores or restaurants. The survey says visits to grocery stores, restaurants, and pharmacies have jumped this month compared to last month. For now, reporting live in Indianapolis, I'm Aliyah Hodges for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.